Hello guys, we're going to be practicing JavaScript coding. Uh, we will start with very easy questions. Uh, this is the website, uh, I don't know how to pronounce, idabit.com and there are challenges and I like those questions and I'm going to be going over those questions. So I'm going to start with the first question, return the sum of two numbers. So let's see the question. In this question, it says create a function that takes two numbers as arguments and returns their sum. And there is example. The function name is addition and the arguments are three and two. And it'll definitely output five because three plus two is five. Addition, negative three and negative six. It'll output negative nine. And addition seven and three output 10. So let's code this. To code it, I'm going to be using a website called codepen.io and then I'm going to click start coding. You guys can sign up and create your own account. Uh, this is a very useful website. You can easily uh, use this website for HTML, CSS or JavaScript coding. And I'm going to be using this only for JavaScript and I'm gonna have my console over here ready and another thing I'm gonna do is on the behavior I will turn off auto update in preview so that it doesn't keep giving me outputs every time I uh, type some code I'm gonna click run instead and then it'll show me the code so let's start coding we're going to have a function name addition and it's going to take two arguments. So I will be doing this function name addition and the parameters will be A and B. So this function is going to return A plus B. E. That's all. How are we going to check if this is correct, if this works correctly? So we're going to put our uh, output on console, console.log. And we're going to be calling this function. How do we call it? We basically type in the name of the function and we will put the arguments some sample numbers so I'm gonna put 3 and 2 that's all and I'm gonna run it and it should print out the result over here so waiting and it prints out 5 that is correct let's give another one negative 3 and 2 it should negative 1 as you see it's negative 1 and this one works that's all for the first question so you guys can go down on code and put the same code over here and it'll work that's all thank you for watching please uh, if you like the video please subscribe and if you have any additional questions please put on the comment thank you